Old Nintendo Gamer and Son. Hello and welcome back to Old Nintendo Gamer and Son. As we're laughing and absolutely scandalous playing of a trombone in Trombone Champ in the single player. As um, once again, I am a jubilant horn lord this time. Uh, we haven't even tried to be a trombone. Uh, there seems to be other trombones to unlock, but we have worked through a lot of the songs in this gay game game. I got 16 tracks left to play through, and I'll be doing eight tracks every episode now. So this is part five, or melody five rather. We'll be finishing on melody six, but uh, let's get through the next eight. And this is Rosamund the Beer Barrel Poker by. Uh, Harmia Yevoda. Yevoda. Ve, uh, this poker, originally written by a Czech musician, swept the world in popularity throughout World War II. Six star difficulty. It's Mangle, another poker. 1,000 workers, a full year, to produce a single trombone. That's why they're $2 billion each. <laughs> Oh, I'm off it today. call me a philistine there but i have absolutely no idea what that song is and uh, i've said it before it really does help if you know the song so maybe if you're uh, playing this game and you think what the hell am i playing and struggling through it go and listen to the original song and it might help you uh, struggle through um, a six star difficulty rosamund uh, on to beethoven's ode to joy loosely based on an ode by frederick schiller this heavenly piece was adopted as the anthem of Europe in 1972. The trombone is related to the trumpet. They're cousins. Let's get um, cousining. Are you ever going to do a trumpet champ? Let's do some Miles Davis stuff. Yeah. <laughs> 
uh, studious. Oh no, I'm a jubilant, jubilant uh, horn lord. This time I'm a jubilant. Oh yeah! National anthem of Europe is a cinch. Thank you very much, Beethoven, for that beauty. Old MacDonald by Thomas de Dufresne. I never knew uh, the actual composer of Old MacDonald. And this famous folk song about a dude with a farm dates back to the 1700s or possibly earlier. His animals make funny noises, and now oh, you can too. Let's make. Uh... Oh, yes, Mozart's last words. Oh, trombone! Not McDonald's, I know. <laughs> Calibration went off at the end then, but uh, just managed to hold it to an A. Go on, A. Yes. Uh, a million points scored. Um, we're hitting high scores every time. Oh! Last episode, we had some stars and stripes. We also had uh, uh, the British national anthem, the English national anthem. Now we're going to Canada. Uh, Calixe Lavelle. Originally composed for Saint Jean Baptiste Day banquet in 1880, this didn't become the de facto anthem until 1939. Oh, Canada! Get your two billion dollars ready if you want to be a tromboner. Uh, thank you, old Canada. That's got to be an A rank, but uh, I was going to be surprised if it was an S rank. Very happy with that. Uh, on to the next track, Danny Boy. This timeless Irish ballad by Frederick Weatherly, set to the tune of London Derrier, isn't typically played at full volume on a trombone. It's time to change that. And I don't really know Danny Boy, even though... Uh, to this day, scientists really don't know how a trombone makes a sound. It's about the reeds. The reeds, I tell you, man. Nobody believes me. <laughs> Bye. 
Champ at the end. Uh, gutted a lot of champ in the middle there. That's got to be an S rank. That was nearly spot on. It's so close to going through the side. Uh, thank you, oh Danny boy. Mountain King by Edvard Grieg, which is a classical, amazing. Dun, 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 dun. The Hall of the Mountain King. This famous piece written for play, Piagnit, Gint, Gint, Gint. Oh God, excuse my philistinery. Accompanies a scene in which the main character meets a host of trolls and goblins. It's very spooky, apparently, and this is spookily eight stars. Good luck out there. We're gonna need it. Faça. Oh, I missed that. Ah, oh, I was looking down. Yeah. In the Hall of the Mountain King. 
That'll lose me one rank, surely. Oh, just skipped over the A. You can call me the Greek master. Well, if I had an S rank in that ever. Uh, we're going on to a nine star difficulty. This is the seventh of eight tracks in this episode. This will be a slightly short one, the looks of it. But this is from Holy Wow and Meringue. A sad attempt at composing a meringue song, a fast-paced Latin American dance originating in the Dominican Republic. Let's merengue away. Don't you wish you were back in 20 million BC? Inventing the first trombone. <laughs> That was fast at the end. I like that. Um, woo, 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 the up and down uh, fluctuating notes. Couldn't make an A this time. Uh, fluctuating notes in the middle there. Those are fun to perform. Uh, on to the last. And from Canada. We're going to France. La Massé, from 1792, the national anthem of France, written by Claude Joseph Roger de Lille, adopted as France's national anthem in 1795. This rousing European march is also used as a song of revolution. This rendition was performed by the U.S. Navy Band. Let's have a listen. And let's uh, add some melodic tunes to La Massé. Papier. <clears throat> yes, baguettes and toilet paper. Ah, oh, he's pulled off an S rank salute to the French national anthem, and that will wrap up this part five of Trombone Champ with me, old Nintendo gamer. We've got eight more tracks to do, and we'll be doing that in Melody Six. Stick around for the next couple of days for that. Bye bye. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe and give us a like if you've enjoyed our content. You can follow us on X. Facebook, Instagram, and Threads. 
We also have a private Discord server for some laid-back gaming chat. And if you're feeling generous, you can support us via coffee. All the relevant links are in the description below.